Buenas tardes todos. Uh, bienvenidos a un episodio nuevo de Great Hotel Reviews y hoy um, estoy finalmente uh, en la ciudad de, de México. So uh, let's go ahead and just take a look here at this amazing, amazing Airbnb right in La Roma Norte, which is the heartbeat of Mexico City and a really trendy and, you know, I like chic things part of uh, Mexico. So let's just really get going. So right here, this is the first bathroom of two. Um, there's a pintura over here of, of the, the Lord's Angels. And there's like a little tambourine they're playing with there. That's pretty chic. Um, we've got the, you know, the sink there, typical. So this is kind of the living area here. To, you know, you socialize with your friends. You've got a full-on kitchen here. Now, one thing I will say when you're in Mexico is, I look, there is a filter on here. And you can swap between... Let me get you here. You can swap between the two if you want, but if you want, but I still would not recommend drinking the water in Mexico unless you want Montezuma's Revenge. If you don't know what Montezuma's Revenge is, go ahead and drink the water here and just be on the toilet all day. If that's what you want, that yay. Be, um, what you, what, what, people who make dumb decisions get dumb consequences. <laughs> is that something that people say? I don't know. So they do a really nice job of letting you know of all the different places you can eat here with a description. I got me a t-shirt, Adidas, Mexico City, you know, you got to have the limited edition stuff, you know, and then over here you got a lot of chic artwork. So I've been making myself very comfortable. You can see where the booty bin. <laughs> Just, I actually just woke up from a nap because the gorditas put me to sleep. So if you just get in here, I mean, what what is more essential to life than energy drinks, beer, and water? Uh, you got to make sure, like I said, I can't stress this enough, to have the water, the aqua infusionata, the pina coco. <laughs> Gotta have the pina coco. Uh, people love Coca-Cola down here. I've seen a lot of Coca-Cola. Um, and uh, and also this lady as well. And some other things that are cool. This artwork is really chic. Uh, and then you come here and you see this dragon, this Mexican skull, um, this uh, lilac. And then you see all kinds of books. I just know, all I know about the host is that he speaks English, uh, Spanish, and also French. And he's very, very cultured and worldly, it seems like. It, pretty much what I'm aspiring to be. Can you, oh, let, me try, let me use my strong hand. I just let, let me use let me use my strong hand, child. God, this is going terribly. All right, so then we're out here on this patio area, and we are actually in the rainy season of Mexico right now. It's a little bit cooler here than back at home. It's a solid, you know, 60, 70 some degrees, which is really nice. Um, and by the way, this door, for security reasons, if you open it and you're out there and you shut it, well, you're stuck outside. So, you gotta be careful of that, Mike. Goodness, my arms. All right, so we're just a little bit over here. Astronaut there. So this is kind of cool. Uh, this is the bedroom. The carpet is just a little bit too big for the room, but who, so, so what? Um, got a window to the outside. Some more books. Like I said, the host here is very, very inteligente. Either that or he just collects books. Another, something, there's, a, there's something going on here with an astronaut theme too, which is pretty rad. And then we just get into the bathroom here where there's a, a painting here of, um, some marionettes, so we got this, so, what is this, those, those like dolls or whatever, and then you've got like a marionette, a bowling pin, an ostrich, a, 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 a ball bag, <laughs> wearing a graduation cap, what the, oh, and then over here we've got the La Ducha, okay, so that is, so that is this episode of Great Hotel Reviews. I, I know it's longer, but I appreciate y'all being here, sticking with me and supporting this channel and all the work that we're doing to educate the world on how awesome all of these places are to discover. Goodbye.